Hi, and welcome to Kickstarter Conniption. My name is Kevin Delp. And I'm Melissa Delp. And we're happy to be part of the Tantrum House family. In this video series, we're talking about games that are coming to Kickstarter soon, games that are currently on Kickstarter, or games that were funded on Kickstarter. And today, we're talking about a game that was funded on Kickstarter. I hate zombies. Who doesn't love to hate zombies? This game is the first micro game from Board Game Geek, and it's for two to 12 players. So let's look at the components. There's just a handful of cards. In the base game, there's actually 12 character cards, and then there's a special card, and you have the rule book. If you back the Kickstarter, you also got six extra character cards. Now, the cool thing is that each of these character cards on the human side has special abilities. This game is extremely easy to play. You deal one card to each player. The first player plays rock, paper, scissors with the person to the left or right. Whoever loses becomes a zombie. At that point, half the players become zombies, and the other half are humans, and the game begins. Now the zombies are the only players who actually take a turn. The first zombie picks a human to the right or to the left, and then plays rock, paper, scissors. The one who wins wounds the other player. Now if the human wins, there may be some other effects, like the policeman who deals two damage instead of one, or the bulldog who actually kills the zombie if he wins with a rock. Now wounds are not good because once a human gets his second wound, he turns into a zombie. And a zombie's a little stronger, so he takes three wounds before he's dead. And dead means that player is out of the game. So the game is over when there's only one team left, either the humans or the zombies. So will humanity rise to the challenge or will those filthy brain munching zombies take over? So this game is a party game. There's not a lot of strategy going on. The rules and mechanics are a little tongue in cheek. The rock, paper, scissors determines the fate of humanity. So some of the things that we actually like about the game, uh, number one would be the art and how um, each character has the alive version and then the zombie version. It's fun just to look at them all. And the special abilities, abilities on the humans are pretty cool. I mean, it's even fun to play different ones on, at different games. Um, the game is also pretty simple. It's uh, compact, just a few cards, uh, quick. So those are some good things about it. But it's rock, paper, scissors. How many times are you going to do that before you feel like you're part of the twilight zone? <laughs> um, and there's also the elimination aspect. So some people can be sitting on the sidelines, although it can be kind of fun watching other people battle if they really get into the characters. Yeah, it's fun if you have the right group of people. So if you hate zombies as much as we do, go get this game.